So there's actually a ton of different reasons why I have upgraded from the Model 3 to the Model Y as my daily driver. But the biggest one is probably going to be with this hatchback. I have a ton more room back here than Model 3 and it really allows me to move stuff for like my projects or really just kind of camp back here, have more room and I really like that. However, there's one thing that still kind of bugs me. So we actually installed the Tasmanian floor mats back when I got my first Model Y and absolutely love them. It really helps protect the interior and they fit beautifully. But the back seats, when I fold them down to move either wood for projects that I've been doing around the house or when we bought tile, there's no way to really protect them besides throwing a towel on them or whatever. And I don't really care for that. It doesn't really protect them. So Tasmanian has actually came out with seat back covers for the second row. Super excited for those. So let's go ahead. I actually have them right here. We're going to go ahead, open them up install them and check them out. Uh, I've been getting a lot of questions about them online, so hopefully I will be able to answer everything for you guys. So without even cleaning this, so this is the floor mat from Tasmanian for the rear of the trunk here. It actually does have that ridge down the middle so you can actually open this. I keep cleaning towels down there, but you can actually see it's caught some, I don't know, some drips from groceries or whatever, and it's really kept the carpet under there really looking good. But back here you can kind of see there's some lines from when I had some wood and there's some sawdust and some little splinters from when I have been transferring wood for some house projects. So hopefully the covers for the seat backs will prevent that. Okay so these are the seat back covers with something a little special down there which we'll go over in a minute. But um, you can see this will fit on that side and this one will fit on the other side. Now the best thing to do with these is probably let them sit in the sun or whatever, kind of just like the floor mats to really help kind of flatten them out from shipping and everything. So I'm going to go ahead and let them sit out for a few and then uh, we'll go ahead and install them. But while those are sitting out, I'll go ahead and go over this with you. So we actually went over the sunshade for Model Y a, a while back and this is the newly revised one. The sunshade actually works really, really well. But the one thing I saw some people kind of questioning and wondering if it could be fixed is how it kind of sagged a little bit in the middle. Now, I didn't really have too big of a sagging issue with mine, but uh, that is now fixed. They have these, they're little like magnetic holders that you can install so that it will not sag. It will actually kind of pick it back up so you can just install these two little metal clips. Uh, they have a blue film on them. They don't actually stay blue. But you can install these up on your roof there. And then this magnet, once you put your sunshade up, will just click right through it. And that way it will help hold it up and prevent that sagging issue. Probably one of the best ways to prevent that from sagging. I wish I would have had this on my trip to Moab. That would have been nice because it was a scorcher, very hot. In case anybody out there is curious about that, the new ones come with these and an improved sunshade. So if you're looking for something like that, they are now shipping those out. Okay, so we're gonna start with this side and you wanna install these with the seats laying flat. I got a lot of questions though of people saying, can you use them when the seats are raised? Yes, but you wanna install them when they're flat, not when they're sitting up like this. Um, so it does already have like some little like Velcro strips that will help adhere to this. So we can go ahead and just kind of align it up and you can peel it up as much as you want till you get it exactly how you want it. Okay, so that side's good. I'll go ahead and jump and do the other side. So this one actually does have the cutout for the handle right here, which will allow you to drop that, but it does not have a cutout. So it will always be a 60-40 split with these. But if you needed to remove them so you could get that 60-40 split, you can just take them right off. Okay, so now we can go ahead and put these back up. 
Oh, and they look like OEM. That's really nice. You can't even really tell they're on there. Let's see how it looks from the back. Looks good. I'll go ahead and move this side over just a little bit to cover that. Much better, but I do want to actually test this out with the dogs because that's actually kind of one of the reasons why I wanted these so much. Yeah, I put a lot of wood and stuff back here that I'm like transporting and we're doing a lot of house projects and I wanted that utility of the Y, but I also wanted this for the dogs. They don't really fit in the Model 3 because they're big dogs. They're like 90, 120 pounds and I wanted those seat backs protected. I didn't want them tearing it up with their claws or anything like that, so that will help protect it. And that's what I really wanted. Also, it'll make it so the fur doesn't stick to the back of the carpet because it's the that carpet too. Doesn't. So let's go ahead and get a dog. We'll try one at a time so they don't get too amped up and hyper right away and uh, see how it goes. Okay, so here we have this. I did go ahead and get this cool little like stool that you can actually just open like that. So the dogs don't have to jump. They can just walk up there and then right in. Otherwise they have to go this way and I didn't want that to get scuffed up. Come on, use the stairs. Come on. Get up there. Go on. Go on. Oh, it's leading in the car. Come on, Mr. Kit. Hey, you're not using video of the balloon? Use the stairs. Oh, okay. Oh, I didn't see the camera. Too. Use the stairs. Oh. Sit, sit, sit. <laughs> Don't get the camera. Wait. Oh, Kit's going for the camera. Oh, yeah. He's gonna get a snake. You have to sit. Sit. Lie down. Oh! Okay, got both. <laughs> okay, so I think the doggies approve. I really wanted this mat though, because I want to take them on a lot more trips. I want to really take them out and go further away from home. But I want my car to be protected. That's the biggest thing, is I just don't... Oh yeah, they saw the treat drop. I just don't want the back of my seats getting torn up. And this should prevent that and make cleaning a lot easier. Like they're walking all over with those claws. Hopefully you can see those. And it is protecting everything. So we absolutely love that. Um, so I'm gonna give this two thumbs up, but I have one thumb holding the camera. So it's two, trust me. Uh, but I'll go ahead and link everything down below. If you wanna check them out, definitely do so. But yeah, a lot of you guys have been purchasing these floor mats. I highly recommend them. We actually did a video review on that. I'll link it up above. And um, I'm really happy that these came out the way they did. I love them. The dogs are super happy. They get to go for car rides again now that everything's there. Yeah, I know. Yeah, you're so excited. You get to go for car rides. So yeah, if you are looking to pick up any of these products from Tesmanian, feel free to check them out. All linked down below. And using code Derek will get you 10% off of your order. And Abstract Ocean has also started to carry their products, so you can check them out there as well if you would like. I am just super excited to have these though. I've really wanted to take the dogs out a lot more. It's actually why I bought an X to begin with. And unfortunately, right after I bought the X, I came out with the Raven model, so I went ahead and sold the X. And then the Y was gonna get here so quick, I didn't re-up the X. I went ahead and just waited for the Y. But having a car that we can really fit the dogs in and really make them comfortable in because it is a lot taller here than like the S. The three would just be a lot harder since it's not a hatchback. It really makes a world of difference to me. So I can't be happy enough with these because now I love my cars and I love my dogs, but I want to keep my cars protected while transporting my dogs. So now it's the best of both worlds. We've got the floor mats, we've got the seat covers. The one thing though I did notice, um, Layden did it. Um, she did put her paw on this center console. Now it didn't get scratched or anything, but it is something I'll probably kind of keep an eye on. They haven't been in the car in a while, so there's cameras and everything. There were snacks, so they were all getting amped up. So that might have been why, but I might try to find something to cover this um, or even like the net thing that goes between these two seats. But definitely comment down below, is this something that you would use for your car? Is this something that you would use for like 
your dogs to protect the seeds from or like doing projects around the house like carrying lumber stuff like that anything really helps protect it but definitely comment down below and we can talk about it down there as always though huge thanks to our channel sponsor abstract ocean if you are looking to accessorize your tesla model sx3 or why much like this one definitely check them out all linked down below and using code tesla inventory will get you 15 percent off of your first purchase don't forget to thumbs up that video if you enjoyed it go and click here to subscribe here for some other ones and we'll see you guys in the next one bye